Hi everyone, I'm gonna show you how to request for your LOA or letter of authorization from the MaxiCare website using the member gateway. So on the website, you just go to maxicare.com.ph, sign in, and from this one, select as a member and sign in to the member gateway. You head out to login and just type in your credentials you'll be asked for a one-time pin and that's usually gonna happen if this is your first time accessing the site for a long time but generally it should send out a text message to the phone number that you have added during the registration or when you set up your profile so it's gonna route you to your gateway page and that's where we will request the LOA so for just this video, we're just going to create a request and I'll show you on a different video what it looks like and where to go to fi figure out if your LOA has been approved or not. So initially, you'll get this banner. Just close this out. We go up top, health services. I need to consult a doctor and then other providers request for letter of authorization. From here, you'll see information has been added. And you'll see this small box, just close this out, and then type in your hospital that you're going to visit. And then the doctor, your doctor. All right, so this is my OB. I will be visiting her again. So we already spoke a few Saturdays ago. So we're gonna do a follow-up. So just input follow-up checkup and a reading of lab results. And my concern was um, PCOS, Slash. Little to no miss. And then you're going to see here below, the request is valid for three days from the time that you request. So it's 18, 19, 20. So we're going to meet on a Friday. So, oh, Saturday. So this will be perfect by then. And I always request it um, at least a day or two early from the time that I am going to visit because, of course, you will be needing to wait for the confirmation. So this feedback is not going to be there all the time. It's the first time I saw that, so might as well do it. So here on the upper right-hand corner, you'll see your full name. Go to your inbox or the envelope and you will actually see here if you are or you're going to see rather your requested LOA for the, from the past. So for mine, most of them are already approved. So let's refresh and see if my new one is already here. But if it's not there, that's fine. You can just log out. Just come back after uh, an hour or two. It should be there. Um, you'll just check the service date, basically when you requested it, or rather this one here. So you'll see that um, sometime later and see you will find out if it's approved or not. So from this point, we're basically just going to wait until that is already approved. Once that's done, you will download the file, have it printed, and bring it to your chosen hospital. And that's how you can create your LOA from the member gateway.